Innovative ideas are propelled by research. New technologies, goods and services that improve our lives are made possible by it. University of East London School of Education and Communities researchers represent a variety of academic specialties, including the early childhood and education, social and community work, teacher education and training, global development politics and sociology. Whether you're a student researcher, whether you're an academic member of staff researcher or a visiting researcher, the researchers we have in Educom are doing absolutely fantastic work. A lot of it's groundbreaking, a lot of it has a huge impact in the community as well, but it's not as well known as it should be. And so today is a start of changing that and actually publicising what we do and making people aware of what we do. All of us come to research in so many different ways and so many different forms. As Richard's highlighted, it is that recognition. What are we doing? Why do we do it? and what impact does it have to our communities that we serve. This is really important. University of East London School of Education and Communities researchers are tackling some of the most significant worldwide problems. They are looking at how our online behaviour affects the world, improving inclusive education for kids and developing software to help mental health. You would have seen walking around the pictures from the fieldwork, the publications, the collaborations both within school and also from partners in other countries. One of the things we're very proud of at the School of Education and Communities is our involvement in what's called the OLAS initiative, which is refugee education. So our research on the experience of migrants and how migrants are impacted by their travels. Using the development game in research promotes collaboration and interdisciplinary approaches. It encourages researchers from different disciplines to come together, exchange knowledge, and collaborate on shared research goals. You belong to a rich family family. One of the important research projects at Educom demonstrates how a noisy environment affects children's early cognitive and emotional development. I'm working on projects about digital financial inclusion because in 2026, cash is supposed to be ending and we're just going to be using online digital money for disabled people and people with a, particularly people with learning disabilities this can be quite a problem because um, they maybe have been used to just using cash so our project is really about um, working with our students researchers um, who have a learning disability and we've been running focus groups to find out what people with learning disabilities really feel about this my research is uh, kind of interested in looking at what is inclusive education for children with disabilities mean in the context of Somaliland. My research really utilises uh, both traditional and non-traditional forms of, of data collection. My PhD looked at um, socio-cultural issues in education and how to teach transformatively instead of that typical uh, warm-up skill game approach that we see in many schools, football, cricket, rugby. Instead, can we be doing something more appropriate to the modern era? Self-defense, kinball as an invasion game, kabiddi, gratitude, body positivity, chalking. Beyond the university campus, Educom's research has a significant positive impact on people, communities and businesses. It continues to be at the forefront of scholarly success and societal improvement. Thank you.